at 6.40 on a Saturday. I gotta be quiet because Kylie's sleeping. This is what the apartment looks like right now though. Because we bought a condo and we're moving today, baby. Let's go. So far the process has been an absolute nightmare. We got new flooring installed, immediately found water underneath the flooring. We had a plumber come out. The flooring guys who had to level our floor put some sort of like a gritty, some, some gritty substance that they tried to put down the kitchen sink. Yeah, his best guess is the sink started to clog up. They freaked out, tried to plunge it and blew the bottom of the trap open. And that's why I'm up early on a Saturday. Someone from the flooring team is now gonna come out and do an inspection, see if they need to potentially rip up any floorboard. Wow, what fun. Fun. But we're staying positive. We love the place. We can't wait to show you. I'm definitely gonna do like a full tour of the place. Should really show you guys the space and all the work we did. But today, I just wanna do like a moving vlog. Hopefully today goes smoother. Either way, who cares? We're homeowners and we're stoked about it. We love this place and we're excited to take you along for the journey. Let's go to the new condo. Just wanted to give you a quick peek of the view. All right, now I just gotta wait for the flooring guys, and after that, we gotta wait for the movers, and then after that, we gotta unpack, and after that, we pre-ordered some pizza, and then after that, hopefully we'll drink. Whew. Let's go, long day, boys. All right, the flooring guy just came. He sees that there's water under there. It looks like we should be able to get it replaced fairly easy. I'm pretty sure this is all gonna be covered by Home Depot. But now I'm gonna head back because the movers are coming in like an hour and 20. I might have to cruise back here to get the internet set up. But until then, I'm gonna go help Kylie finish with the last bit of packing. Before I did, I just wanna show you guys this beautiful, beautiful Saturday morning we got here. We are obsessed with this view. All right, let's go cruise back. All right, literally just walked in. The internet guy's called. They're at the other place, so heading back. The internet guy's doing his thing over in the bedroom, so getting caught up on the reader. All right, internet guy came. The issues are never ending. We have now have a source for the internet. So I don't know if I give you this backstory. The internet guy actually came yesterday, and all our internet cables were like cut out of the walls or something. I, I don't know. So he had to get a specialist to come out here and run some cabling from our 10th floor condo down to like the main junction box in the basement. That's done, but he can't turn on the internet. So now we also have to have another technician come out to get our internet up and running. So hopefully that happens, happens soon because it's gonna be a really boring few days until we get internet if it, if it comes to that. But anyways, he's gone, whatever. Gotta just keep moving. Let's go help Kylie. The movers are probably already at the apartment. I'm gonna go help Kylie do whatever we need to do for that. And then we'll get things in in here, in this condo that we that's ours, that we're stoked about. <sighs> Let's go. This is crazy how fast they were. They, it only took them, what, an hour and a half to pack up this whole place? Not even, they were here right at nine. So they're under, under an hour. Wally movers, if you're in Chicago, use them. This is great. So but look at this crazy. empty apartment. I miss this place. Everything's gone. The bedroom is empty. We miss this place. All right, so what is this like my, this will be my fourth trip? <laughs> <laughs> going back to the condo so that we can, you know, let them in and they'll do the unpacking and whatnot. Either way, we're moving along with today. Let's uh, let's get Farley to her new place because she's been stressing and freaking. She doesn't know what the hell is going on. All right, back to the new condo. We're at the condo. Movers just got here. They should be bringing stuff in soon. Excited.
We're in. We're fully in. The movers were awesome. Once again, Wally movers. They are so fantastic. Oh, I think she's got to go potty. I would take the dog out and then start unpacking. Let's go. You're no good. Farley's first walk around the new block. How you liking it, little girl? Farley. Yeah. <laughs> Stop for a little lunch. So we got taco burrito. Probably. No, you don't get that plastic bag. They gave us an extra taco. They did. <laughs> Whoa, you're a pig. Oh my God, are you crazy? Right? I slammed mine. No, 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 I'm sorry. All right, time to get to work. All right, let's unpack. books because we both have well you don't know the second part I was gonna say because we both have too many coats could also be an issue maybe maybe it's the books maybe it's the coats I don't know but yeah it's finally pizza time we gotta drive there it's like 20-30 minutes so we're gonna go grab the car Kylie's taking the pop out I'm gonna go grab the car meet them out front and uh, we shall be feasting and then more unpacking I I'm drinking at some point I already started. <laughs> that's why she's a beast also, we're getting like, I'd say a level one and a half sunset out of 10, and it's still sick. Once this thing gets up, like a real good high quality sunset's gonna be freaking unreal. Either way, whatever, this place is awesome. Let's go get pizza. Tell these guys what pizza we're getting, I guess, huh? Five squared, so good. Detroit style, little airier. It's like all through Instagram. You like literally just DM on an Instagram. You can get them through Grubhub and stuff like that, but you just DM your order on Instagram. You go pick it up. They give you cooking instructions. It takes 10 minutes in the oven to reheat it. It's freaking amazing. It's in, I wanna say Avondale is where we're going. So basically in, in a DM, they just like say, go to this address. Then they send you a picture of like a warehouse. And they're like, we're back here. And they like circle it. And they're like, just text this number and Jen will bring it out to you. So it's real like, I don't know, mom and pop pop-up shop. I mean, it really is the best though. It's delicious and amazing. Anyways, I gotta focus on driving, but uh, Five Squared coming up. Right there, there we go. Five Squared Pizza, baby. Here she is. She is so tiny. I know, she's, she's such a little furball. Teeny, teeny, teeny. Yeah, yeah, yeah we'll you see you around. Thank you. Yeah. All right, we've got the pizza, and let's go home and feast. Okay, sorry if the uh, lighting's bad in here. Our last place had the light switches. This place needs a lot more lamps, so we got to get some lamp action going on in the condo. But uh, either way, I have to show you guys this. Five squared threw in free brownies for us. Me and Kylie each got one. Look at this. Marshmallow, I'm assuming at least, marshmallow brownie. How good does that look? Oh my god. It's so soft. All right, one more bite. Mm, I could eat this whole thing, but I have to put this away, and then I'll finish this after pizza. Taking a lot of self-control not to slam this, but look at this. 
Have you ever seen anything so heavenly in your life? Dude, Five Squared brings it. All right, Five Squared, coming soon. Oh. Mmm. That's the best pizza in Chicago. Here's the two I'm eating. Smoky white. This has got ricotta cream sauce, caramelized onions, smoked mozz, ricotta dollops, extra virgin olive oil. Mm. That's ridiculous. Then this sausage one, it's vodka sausage. Vodka sauce, crumbled Italian sausage, hot jardinera relish, and parmigiano reggiano. Mm. I probably said those last two Italian things way wrong. Oh my freaking God. This is unbelievable. This is how you take a pause on a hard day of work. We are in this. It's crazy because I don't even like pizza and I love this. I am legitimately almost fall off that one slice. Mmm. Oh my god. I'm only having a couple more bites. I'm taking a breather. Oh, wacko zacko. What up, doll? Baby boy. Baby boy. Your boy just got casted on Chicago PD. It airs February 18th or February 8th. I shoot it next week. I'm in that bitch. I got like five lines. Hey, I'm speaking role. Like I'm a leader of like this group of robbers that they uh, we get caught and I turn up. No Fuck way. Yes. Bro, we're going to have to have Bro, a Bro, let's party. go. Yeah. Fuck yes, dude. That's so awesome. But let's talk. Uh, I'll let you, I just want to tell you that story. We're on our way to Detroit now. I just want to call you. I know you're stressing. I love you. Shit happens. You're going to get over it because you're a G. I love you both. And uh, let's go, baby. All right. Thanks, brother. I love you too, man. Make sure you tell uh, Aaron and Eric I said hi too. I will for sure. Have a good night. All right. You too, brother. Peace. Wow, that's an awesome phone call. Guess everybody watch Chicago PD for Zacco. That's fire. That's sick. All right, we're done eating. Time to get back to packing. Five squared, you're the greatest. You made the stressful moving so much better. Pack time. Un unpack time. Whatever, I'm loopy. checked in in a while I kind of quit doing footage because we just been hustling but most of this area is cleared ish we're making progress it's so much better than it was but check this out it is 9 30 pretty sure I uh, first showed the clock I think it was 6 30 in the morning so just a chill 15 hour work day not quite done yet but we have to go make a booze run we're gonna have to finish more crap tomorrow we're just we're not gonna be able to do the rest of this day we're just, we just gotta go get booze that's all there is to it so let's go I don't know what the deal is. They, they don't carry hams at like any of the stores in Chicago in my area. You're gonna have to make some calls, bro. We gotta get some hams around these stores. This is ridiculous. We gotta settle for freaking Miller Lite, dude. Pissing me off. Whatever. There's not many more satisfying drinks than a long day of moving beer. The only contenders might be post-prison beer and, and funeral Jameson. All right, let's do a little more work. Get this couch put together so we can sit somewhere like humans. guys we got the couch done playstations hooked up miller lights are cold i'm gonna get drunk with my wife we worked hard today and we're gonna celebrate by getting drunk and watching movies catch the next vlog we'll take you through the process of getting this place fixed up until i get it get it just right and then we'll take you on a tour and uh hope you guys are enjoying some beer tonight too peace